Hello everybody and welcome back to Tammy's Dolls and today we have a new addition to our monkey line and there will be one more yet to come after this one and that will be it. Um, I know those are my last famous words never hanging out to dry on those because you know me uh, there's always another one. But what has Mary Lou and Mousy Lou been doing? Well they've been putting bows in their hair. But we have a new one here that's kind of on the shy side and we like I said we have Mary Lou we have Mousy Lou, but who is this one? This is Dottie Lou, and Dottie Lou is shy. She's got her hand, her arms covering up her eyes. Now this ape, or this chimp, came from a gentleman that um, was kind of partial to, to uh, this, this, he called him his little guy, so I, I take it he was uh, a boy to him. To me it's gonna be a little girl. But the thing is, is that um, they're, these two are marked underneath their chin, Zim, which means in, a, in like a triangle. So they belong to a certain um, class of chimps that came out in the 1950s, where Mary Lou doesn't have that underneath her, ch underneath her chin. I've looked. I don't see it. Now, unless it's covered by fur, that I'm just not seeing it. But these two here are very, um, you can see them, right? doesn't take much to look, and you can see it there. So it doesn't matter, though. Um, they all love one another. They're all getting to know one another. But this one's a little bit different. And it kind of set me back a bit because I wasn't too sure how I liked it. But I'm starting to sit back and um, just relax and learn what I can do with this this new one, in the new addition to my chimp family. The thing is with this one is, and we'll look at the comparison. Let's get to look at her face. Miss Dottie, the shy one. Let's take a look at her. There she is. Now, she, she is a different cut of chimp that I have. If you can see, these faces look totally straight up at you, right in the camera, where this little gal has more of a downward look. So she's not look, going to be looking, be able to look up at you. Now I can get her to, if I was to do more of a slant on her, then you get to see her better. There we go. And, I, and then you get to see her face a little bit better. We'll zoom up on her face so you can see her. There we go. There she is. Isn't she gorgeous? Dottie, you're beautiful. And she's happy about it. But what else was the difference about her compared to the other two? Now, with Mary Lou, I had to put wires in her arms to get her to so that she had a bit of a, a pose in her, her arms, like I could do things with her arms. She has wire. I put that in myself. Whereas this one came with wire already put into her, um, we're already in her, her arms. This gal here, or this was a guy, he, this one's flat. It has the flat arms. It also has been sewn in the knee area so that it gives the ability that you can bend the knees in. There's a bit of a sewing in here that you can see that the, can you see that? No. Let's come down. Let's zoom in on that. And it's been sewn so that you can bend that, its leg right in. So there's a bit of a, of a, uh, it's been sewn right in here I can feel it and you can do like poses with it now right away my instinct was when it came to the arms because they're so flat you know like look, look at the arms there, there's nothing in there it's just flat material okay now my big concern was maybe I should stuff them right away I thought put a wire down there and stuff them but I'm holding back all of a sudden because I'm finding out there are things that I can do with this ape that I can't do with the others because they are stuffed arms and they do have wires in them. So sometimes it's best just to have a bit of a difference uh, and something unique about each one of your apes. And I think I'm going to keep her just the way she is and enjoy her for the way she is. I like to keep sometimes things to their authentic way. I'm not doing it to be authentic. I'm doing it because of filming and the, the use I can make out of her. That she, whoops, she can do things that the other ones struggle to do. Right away, I can take her and pose her arms right around and she has her sisters right in there with her. And so she might be great as a middle type monkey that can be right in the middle all the time. And her expression is just... Super, you know, the, the three of them can be combined together the way they are. Isn't that wonderful? Look at that look, you know, it's so not to race to make it what I want, maybe use it the way it is originally to be. And look at that little knee just cocked up the way it is and she's just showing off that leg and oh yeah, <laughs> happy little girls. So a nice little trio. Um, I think she blends in quite fine with them. I hope 
uh, the guy's happy I made her into a girl. Um, I had to. I, I didn't. I was going to make it into a boy, but I I sat back and went. You know something? It just isn't hitting me. I wanted three girls. So now we have Mousy Lou, Dotty Lou, and Mousy Lou. And I think they got carried away a little bit with the the bows and the hair. But hey, that's monkeys for you. They got into the bows and they were putting bows all over themselves. So why not? And and so there should be a lot of antics going on with these three. I hope you enjoyed this and seeing this new edition. I think she's cute. I, I, I think in her own way, there's a cuteness about her. And I'm, I'm enjoying her. I think they're just lovely together. So anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. And there is going to be more to come. Right now, in retirement world, I'm doing one thing a lot right now. And that is sleeping. It seems like I hit 2 o'clock and I'm done. And 2 o'clock is when I used to get, I used to get ready for work. Because I had to be at work for 3. 2 o'clock to me is now snooze time. <laughs> time to go down for a couple hours nap. And I've been loving it. And I think I've been just overtired, exhausted, um, pushed myself to my limits. And I am enjoying this, this relaxation hugely. Um, do not miss work at all. I am just enjoying my freedom right now to its full extent. I go where I want, do as I want, feel as I want in the moment. So everybody, keep paying into you. If you have a retirement fund, it is worth it in the end. Do Keep going. You can do it. So everybody, I wish you all a great night and uh, more videos to come. Um, I have a lot of things I want to show you that I've been uh, just kind of lightly mucking into. And um, there's some good things coming up. As far as restorations, not right now. I am really working on my home. I do a little bit and then I want to sleep. A little bit and I want to sleep. My, I need to organize my house a little bit better. And I've been uh, putting things into bins and pulling things out of bins and getting myself ready to restore. And so anyways, stay tuned though. There's a lot of good fun coming up here. So um, I hope you enjoy this. Thanks again for joining me. We'll talk again soon. Bye-bye.